Hey, welcome back to the Humble Urologist. This is Anthony, and the dog is walking around tip tap tapping, tip tap tapping while I'm doing this, so I can't help it. It's totally an impromptu, unplanned, unwhatevered video. Like I said, welcome back. This is the Humble Virologist, and we're in a new location. Actually, it's not totally new. I've been here before, but maybe you've not seen it. Maybe you don't remember it. I'm in the dining room. I'm not in the den area with the fireplace. I'm in the dining room where I typically do stuff, other stuff. This is my designated spot. An unexpected guest stops by on her way to bed. Okay. 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 What did you hear me? Rise. And do I raise a board? I praise the Lord. I give I I I give I I give all the Lord of God and help us for sins. And that's why we do things we do. All right. First thing she says on camera. We're going to talk about watches. Oh. But talking about the Lord's fine too. What do you think about this watch? Well, I love it. You love it? About that? I just love it. You know what it is? Um, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a finger one. It's a micrometer. It's a micrometer. That's right. And this is a watch that I'm going to be talking about oh. on this video. Yeah. So this is what they call an HMT Sona. Can you say HMT? HMT. Very good. Can you say Sona? Sona. Can you say beautiful? Beautiful. Exactly. It is, isn't it? I can tell beautiful because I'm here. You can help me? Yeah. Can you put that on there and measure it? Yes. You put this in here and this tells you, tells me what size it is right there, see? I'm tall. I'm so tall. I'm a giant. You are. Well, I have to be. I'm going to measure this. All right. So this has been Emma. Yes. And and that's a watch. This is a definitely a watch. You have watches too, don't you? Yeah, I have a Mickey watch and I have Sky watch. That's right. Let yeah. me go get it. Well, we'll do that on another show. So tell everybody bye bye and bye bye. See you later. See you later. One minute later. Okay, so Emma has decided she's going to sit with me while I do this recording. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Emma Louise, or as we call her, Emma Lou, or Emma Lulu. Or Squishy Bear. Squishy Bear. I don't call her Squishy Bear, but I think her daddy calls her Squishy yeah, Bear. Yeah, my daddy calls me Squishy Bear. Okay, well, Squishy Bear here and I are going to be talking about an HMT Sona. Now, what is HMT? HMT stands for Hindustan Machine Tools. And it is a watch that is made in India. Now, the Hindustan Machine Tools Corporation is now divided up into a couple of different uh, companies and one of them primarily still makes watches. It was my impression a while back, don't poke your eye out, <laughs> that, uh, <laughs> that they it's quit so making fun. watches, that they went out of business, but actually they're still in business and they're still making watches and they're making quartz watches too. But this is a mechanical watch, a hand wind, hand wound watch and uh, the older models that were back in the 80s that you can still pick up online you have to be careful because there's so many yes. of them that aren't real they're they're fake they're as we call franken watches yeah yeah you've seen them haven't you yeah and uh so we have to be careful when we order them but if you can find the real deal it is an awesome Awesomely beautiful, elegant watch. I love you, Mama. Yes, ma'am. She loves her mama. We got a good mama and daddy 
loving child. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And she loves her grandpa, too. Mm-hmm. Yep. And so uh, I want to get some up-close photos and look at this, and then we're going to do something I haven't done yet. I'm going to break open the back of this and see what's inside. Because, pump. guess what? Crap pump. What? Did you make that picture on that wall? That picture? Yep. Sure did. I painted that picture. Oh. Uh, you guys want to see a picture that I painted? Yeah. Uh, How's that? Uh, can't see. The watch guy is uh, also an artist. Yeah. Paintings and prints I'm for sale. A, I'm an artist. <laughs> I make Henry. I just make Henry and Peppa Pig. Henry. I'm an artist. You are. Henry and Peppa Pig. You, you, you painted Peppa Pig or something? Yeah, I painted Peppa Pig. I love cool. Peppa Pig. I like Peppa on Pig. Oh, that's what you call it. <laughs> so. <laughs> Are your grandpa so silly? <laughs> hey, grandpa. Mama said. <laughs> One cool thing about uh, HMT is that, unlike a lot of companies, they did and still do make everything in-house. This was a, a company that was started in India so that India could make their own stuff. It started about 1953, shortly after their independence. And so uh, they ended up developing, though, everything necessary to make everything in-house so that they wouldn't have to depend on anybody Mama, else. However, a lot, of, a lot of the quartz watches uh, at some point in time, I believe, were uh, Miyota movements. So they did at least get some Japan help. And, uh, well, anyway, we're going to look at this close, and we'll get back in just one moment. Like I said earlier, HMT is the company that was started in India to not only make watches but to make machine tools and it became the largest and predominant manufacturer of watches in the whole country you can still find HMT watches online you can find the old ones like this one or you can find the brand new ones that they're still making quite honestly they're not as pretty as this this is a uh, 35 millimeter case has a uh, lug to lug of 43 and uh, it has a 18 millimeter lug width and it's about nine and a half millimeters thick it is hand, hand wound and uh, the crown is not signed on the back you can see HMT and some other details about uh, you know where it's made and things like that it's very plain other than that Inside, though, you can see that this is a 17 jewel HMT hand wound movement and it's taken away. This is the first time I've had the back off, and it looks pretty good to me. Um, you can see the jewels there, you can see the, the movement just ticking away. Um, you know, what more is there to say? It's very simple, but all of this is you know in house. So when HMT made their watches like this, they made them. Uh, there because it was hard for them to get stuff from outside of the country. They wanted to have something that is all homemade. And, you know, when you stop and think about it, HMT is a government-owned or at least government-run business. Now, you can see here, when you look up close at the dial, the problems that you find when you get one of these from online. This has been a repainted dial. And I think the watch is original but it has been refurbished, unfortunately. It's almost impossible to find one that has not been refurbished, if not completely Franken-watched. And, uh, however, you know, from at least from a distance, this is a pretty watch. And uh, I'm happy I have it. I just wish I could find one that was more original. If you have one, let me know, and maybe we could look at it sometime. So, thank you, Emma, for being with me today on this episode of The Humble Horologist. Can you say, Humble Horologist? Homologist. Say that again. Homologist. Sounds good to me. We'll see you next week with another video, another watch, 
And uh, who knows, maybe Emma will come back. If you leave fan mail and let us know what you think about Emma, I'm sure she might pay another visit. Until then, remember, watches are replaceable, but time is not. I will be back another day. I will be back Halloween and next.